Hey, it's Daps here. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm super excited to share another video with you. And in this video, I want to show you real quick how to use AI to clone literally any website online, whether it's an HTML website or it was designed with Wix or designed with any platform out there. And you can have that website as a WordPress website. As a matter of fact, this website will be editable with the most famous wordpress page builder out there and that's elementor if you're excited already about this tutorial so without further ado let's get started into the tutorial immediately just before we jump straight into this tutorial if you are coming to this channel for the very first time you're welcome i'm super excited to have you here i'm dabs i upload videos every now and then around wordpress i teach you the tricks the acts the things that work with wordpress i make you look like a pro even if you're a non-techie so if you're really into wordpress and you want to learn a thing or two about wordpress you should consider subscribing to this youtube channel because i upload awesome videos every now and then around wordpress teaching you how to master wordpress just before you continue this video just take a pause smash that subscribe button and eventually if you find this video quite interesting and useful for you do not forget to give me a thumbs up and let me know if you have any issues in the comments so let's go straight to my screen so right on my screen here is a website that used to be my website uh, that i had deleted so many years ago I recovered this website back. I literally will be doing another tutorial on how to recover back any website that has been deleted. In case you deleted the website 10 years ago, 5 years ago, 7 years ago, it has been totally deleted from the World Wide Web. I'll show you how you can recover that kind of website. So if you are watching this video and I have already done that video already, I will make sure I put the link to that tutorial in the description of this video so you can check it's possible i already made a video already this website currently here is an html website even though it was a wordpress website initially and i'm loading it in another directory on my uh, domain here called best cash center and you can see slash tabs book so if i come here you will see that they have a default wordpress installed on the root domain which is best cash center so for the purpose of this example we would be cloning this website into wordpress so we'll be using a tool called 10 web and i'll leave a link to get to this tool in the description get a jump start on website creation build or recreate any website in a minute with the power of ai and we can just get started for free no credit card literally required so let's hit the get started for free button all right, and that will bring you here to a page where you will need to sign up. You can sign up with Google or sign up with your email, first name and the password to just get started using this platform for free. So I'll be doing that real quick. All right, so I've been able to fill my details here. And the next thing I want to do is to hit the get started for free button. And here you'll be asked some very basic questions like how would you best describe yourself? Are you a digital agency or you're a freelance developer? But whatever you want to say is good here for me i will say i'm a freelance developer how many websites do you manage i can say i manage between 11 to 20. that's really literally up to you to uh, put in those details uh, so right now here we are at the page very crucial so you can see that we have a good number of things we can do here we can create a new website with ai literally and just tell ai design a website like this for me uh, but for the sake of this tutorial here we want to convert a website to wordpress with ai and that's the second option there's another option here for you to migrate with website to 10 web hosting and the fourth one is to optimize a wordpress website let's just convert a website to wordpress with ai and then i will have to come back here and i'll plug this url here i'll copy it and then i'll come back here and i will insert this After I must have done this, the next thing for me to do is to hit the proceed button. And then we can see that uh, this is installing a blank website. Then to create a layout, adding the design elements. So we have to give this some few minutes for this to just finish up uh, cloning this. 
So now our clone has been done and what we have to do is to preview and edit this website. All right, so you can see here that I have literally the same page here that I have here. Uh, I have that page here now on a subdomain on 10web.cloud. Uh, so you can see there are just uh, a little bit of changes here and there. So as you can see, this button now is full. Uh, but right now here is, is small, but now I have it full here. Uh, so those are just a little, little difference that I see from the old to the new. And I, th I think there's an alignment issue here. Uh, I also have that alignment issue here as well. So, but if I come here, uh, uh, it well is aligning well here. Uh, so that's 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 the little uh, bit of changes here and there. So this might not be your own situation. Uh, so I've literally used this tool to do this with other websites, and everything is coming out very clean and slick. But this one is having some issues with alignment. All this can be adjusted and redesigned using Elementor in WordPress. Uh, so that's it. This is exactly uh, a clone of our website. Uh, so that, that's it. Uh, let's come back. So right now here in our dashboard, we can see this is the website here and this is the URL here to our website. We can just easily come to manage. And then this will give us an overview. Uh, so we now have uh, like more like a WordPress dashboard here where we can manage things. But what we can do right now is to still come to our AI builder. And what this plugin has just done right now is that it has only cloned our own page, but it has left other pages on the website. And that's where the hard work really comes in. You literally need to clone all the pages on the website. So once we come down here, I can just literally come to the about page, for example. And I have this here. I can literally just copy this URL again. And then we come back here and I can then add another page. Uh, you can see AI recreation pre-made blank page. Let's just stick with our AI. Uh, let's call the title about and then I'll put the URL here. And then I have the opportunity to create. So as you can see here, this page is creating again. So in a few minutes, this should be done and we'll give it time to create this page. All right, congratulations. Your website was successfully generated with AI. We can preview and edit these two as well. And you can see we have a second page here. A little bit of changes as usual. You can see the image here is not uh, the same size with what we used to have here. This one is a little bit bolder and there is a frame around this image here. Uh, that's just the little, little thing that this AI is missing. But overall, I think uh, the old clone is fantastic. Uh, if you ask me my own opinion, I think this is very good. And this text here is dark instead of white. So all these things are things that can be changed uh, inside of WordPress. So that's it. I'm going to leave this so you can go to the website you want to clone and add as much pages as possible. And you will note that right now, the second page now here is saying about. So once you keep adding up this page, it will keep replicating. So this that is saying third page right now, if I come here and I clone this workshop, it will replace that as workshop because now the AI is able to find all the missing pages and it will fit them into a newly designed website. So that's literally how to go about that. There are still so many things we can do here. Uh, so you can see we have options here for pages. We can also clone our header. So you can see this is cloning all the header as much as possible. Uh, the same thing for our footer. So we can see our footer has been cloned. So we can specifically clone footers and headers singles archive and even slides and bring them into this website uh, we can even bring our clones from other websites and add them into this website and that's the beauty of what this ai tool is able to do for us so i don't want to waste so much time so if you come down here you will see that we have so many things you can do uh, from the image optimization to cloud cdns to settings and 
also ten web uh provide hosting service so you can literally host this website with them and then or you can point this website to a domain name so if you come here you will see that we are using a subdomain from them so we may say we want to point this to our own domain uh, but unfortunately uh, there are a lot of things that are left to do especially for us to even customize because you will say okay let's try to edit this page with elementor those things are things that this plugin is not allowing us to do for free however if you click this you would see that uh, this requires the pro version however this tool is giving you access to use this for free for seven days that's literally amazing so seven days is enough for us to clone our website for us to test this website and do everything we want to do literally for free so why not while wasting time so let's continue let's try to use this for free for seven days so let's experiment with what we have with this tool uh, so let's try to use this you can choose from a one personal site to three to ten agency sites i have not really tested out seriously with all of these things i will make sure i do if i do i will let you know and i'll do more videos for you to see exactly what you get when you use this pro uh, version uh, but what i can do today is just to leave it as personal site one and i'll leave this as monthly and then i would proceed uh, here again you have the option to use a credit card or for you to use paypal right now I'll try to use my credit card so let's try this out okay so you can see successfully upgraded to a personal plan and that's good so plan include optimization and hosting for one website uh 20 25k monthly visitors 10 gigabyte ssd storage 20 gigabyte backup storage full front-end and back-end optimization staging environment user and team management drag and drop editor based on elementor and then the ai builder so let's proceed so this is quite amazing the things you get trying to use this tool uh but again let's just uh, uh come now let's open this in a new tab so now you can see that i have options now to edit this page i can also edit this within web builder uh so let's try to do that and you can see that Elementor is loading up. Uh, that's the beauty about this. We are editing this with Elementor. As you can see, I already have this website already inside Elementor. So I can close my navigator. I can edit this page all I want inside Elementor. So you can see I can I can add a page here since I've not been able to add a page. If I had done that, that would have been good. Uh, I have my about page and my own page here so I can literally edit anything I want to edit. Uh, but that's really not what I'm, I want to focus on right now. The thing is, what if you don't want to use this, um, you don't want to use a 10 web builder, you don't want to use your hosting services, you just want to clone your website, you're comfortable with your own hosting services, you're comfortable using your domain that you already have installed on your hosting account or maybe you even have elementor pro somewhere and you just want to clone that website there so what do you do uh, so right now let's come back to the back end here uh, what we can do now is for us to come to this wordpress uh, icon here and if you click this it will take us to the back end of this website so you can see we are on the back end here uh, so if you come to pages and come to all pages we can see that we have the about page here and we have our own page here we have 10 web cache and we have all these things here that is super boosting our uh, website speed for it to optimize well uh, so what we can do is just come to plugins and we can just come to add new and we can just install a backup plugin to back up our website and then clone our website to another website what i'll be using in this tutorial is for us to use a plugin called wp vivid so if you come here you can search for wp vivid 
I would install this plugin and would also activate this plugin as well. So for the sake of this tutorial, let's say I want to use my existing website for this bestcashcenter.com. So at the back end of this website, Best Cash Center, I can just come to plugin as well and come to add new. And then I would search for a plugin called WP Vivid. I would also install this plugin. I would also activate this plugin as well. So right now what I need to do here is for me to come to this portion here that says key and then I would generate a key and I have this code here so if I click this it will highlight all of them and then I can just literally copy this and then I will come back to uh, my subdomain here and then I will come to auto migration and then I will have to paste my keys here and then I'll save this. And then you can see that uh, our connection is okay. And then I can transfer this website now to my website, bestcashcenter.com. So I would make sure that I have my database and my files here. And then I will eat clone, then transfer. So now this plugin would clone this website and then it will transfer it to my preferred website. Depending on how heavy your clone is, this may take a while. So you can see what I have here is literally almost complete. It's 85% gone. Uh, it may take a while. So the clone has been done. Now this plugin is trying to transfer this. So we give it some few seconds and allow this finish uh, so that we can then go back to our website to check for the clone of this website. All right, so this is done. Uh, we can see a backup tax finish. Please switch a log to check details. So let's just come back here and then let's come to backup and restore. Uh, we can refresh this page. So you can see here now that we received the backup and what we can do with this backup is for us to restore this backup and then we hit the restore button again. Okay. And then we would see that a restoration process is going on. We will allow this complete. This might take a while to, uh, depending on how heavy the website is or the website files are. So we'll give this some seconds, some time to see that this finished. So as you can see on my screen here, this is already at 33%. So you can just give this a watch. It's 50% right now. Uh, so this would conclude in just a few seconds. So let's give this time. So you can see this is done. So we hit the OK button and this will log us out of this WordPress website. Uh, but before we go back, you can just go to my website and let's see what we have. So you can see I literally now have my HTML website. Uh, this one uh, that is loading best car center uh, slash Daps Brook. I now have this as a WordPress website loading directly on best cash center isn't this amazing so for you to be able to go to the back end of this website right now you have to use the same login details you use to create your 10 web and the same uh, to get access to your wordpress you have to use that same credential to log into the new website so this is literally how super simple it is for you to clone any website at all, whether it is HTML, whether it is whatever version they are, and use this powerful AI tool for you to convert them to WordPress website that would be editable with Elementor uh, literally for free. Uh, so that's it. I'll be doing more tutorials around this, how to get the best out of this. Uh, so TenWeb also have an amazing platform. I'll be doing more review about them. So if you find this tutorial quite useful, give me a thumbs up. And if you have any issues, let me know in the comments. I'll be looking out for them. So that's my time for this video. If you want to see more awesome videos like this, subscribe to this channel. Hit that notification bell so that you don't miss amazing videos just like the one you've just seen from me. I would see you in another video. And until then, have a nice time.